Well, the first thing you do is there's a, there's a little rubber, uh, it's a hole right here, but it's covered by a little rubber bushing or something like that. So you take your small knife or something and take that little rubber thing off right there. See right here. Don't want to lose it, but uh, <laughs> so things happen. So I'll put it right there. You do is remove the look hex nut inside the stem here. Loosen it up anyway so you can take the top part off. Set it up. Make sure the water's turned off. Use a loosen this right here. This off. Now this little well down here has a water in it, so I usually use a piece of paper towel. I want to see what's down in there. I like to see how it's fitting, how it's fitting down there. So I roll up a piece of paper towel and put it down in there and soak all the water out. So I like to see what's down in there. Uh-huh. Okay, let me need no pliers and see. All right, you. Uh, here's my new stem here. Uh, you spring and everything. You put the spring back down into the uh, rubber coupling here, and you put this down inside there. I usually line it up. Well, I've already got that one down in there, but I use this right here. Uh, I put this down in there. And then I just put this down on top of it like this right here. I slide it down like, oops, don't, oh another thing, put, make sure you got something down in the sink so you won't lose anything. Not bad. So I, this way I put it down in there like that. And let's see. Right there, spit back down in there. And, uh, Top part here, tighten that back up there. Get my uh, wrench here, uh, just barely, you don't want to over tighten it. Okay, I'm gonna leave it there. We're gonna put the handle back on here, line it up the slot here in the Allen wrench here. Turn it over this way so I can see it. Slide this back on there, like that. Get my Allen wrench here, line it up here. Tighten that up so it'll turn. Yeah. Uh oh, that don't look right. That don't. That don't. That don't look right. <laughs> Well, I had the stem in there. Uh, I had the stem in here uh, like this right here. These slots right here, and this little uh, piece right here. So when the thing turns, it hits here and, and it keeps it from going all the way around in a circle. So I had it turn like that. So I put it, um, put, turn it back around like this right here. So it's two slots, and then now, now, now it it, it stops right there. Alright, so let me go turn the water on and see if it's, if it's uh, leaking.
What the? What the? What the? What the world? Forgot to put this, forgot to put this back on there. Doggone it. Well, got water everywhere. Huh? Got water everywhere. Well, I put that rain or whatever you want to call it, the hole down the nozzle. Well, forgot to tight put the, use my branch to put that back on there. Got water on the floor everywhere. You saw it. Well, let's get all this water up. I'm gonna go try it again. The water, the water cut off valve is in the back room, so I'll go in back in there and see how it works here. And I assume, well, I need to tighten, I'm not gonna, I need to tighten that up. I lift this off so I will make sure I got it in the, on the right uh, direction here. Okay, they're not coming out now. Okay, on, off, on, off. Alright. Let me go in here. Try down everything. Got water all dropping in on my light. You saw that? Now, after I've cleaned up my, my tsunami spill around here, you see that this thing is, is, is not... Uh, it's not leaking anymore. If you turn the water on there, that's what the left side. And it's that's the test. That is the beta test, actual test on off. It's not dripping anymore. And uh that's soft. So that problem now I got uh two more to do. But to be sure you put this thing back on, put this thing right, this little cover back over the hole there. And there you have it. Perfect.